What's good, gangy pants? We're back with another bizarre bub. Scary Comp Volume 75. I guess y'all like to see me piss on myself like a little piss boy. But we're going to look at it today. Hope y'all doing okay. And we're going to get it started. I was about to say something, but I forgot. Let's get it. At approximately 1.30 in the morning, a truck driver was driving down a road that many truckers try avoiding at all costs. According to rumors, the road in question is believed to be cursed as many drivers have either seen or been involved in an accident while commuting to their destination through this route. Okay, now, it's not just accidents that often occur here, but also unexplainable sightings. There have been many reports from drivers who claim to have seen shadowy figures standing on the side of the road as though waiting for someone to pick them up. It's around 1.30 in the morning, Look somewhere in creepy. Louisiana, when a truck driver spots something very peculiar on the road he's on. Peculiar. <laughs> Knowing the history of this place, he takes out his phone and begins to record. I'm, I'm keeping What on. he captures leaves him totally spooked. You know, like a little kid just waved. Heck no. Nah. Did you see it? <laughs> you key nick. Nah, don't wave at me, little jit. Little ghost jit. Nah. Someone or something appears to be squatting on the side of the road doing who knows what before turning around to look at the driver. Aside from the fact that it's late at night in the middle of nowhere, the way in which they turn their head and wave at the camera seems quite unnatural. It's for this reason that some viewers believe that a skinwalker or a cryptid of some sort was caught on camera. Whether a ghost, cryptid, or person, no new information has been brought forth to clarify what exactly was captured. Look how the head turned with the frick? Number eight. There's a mall in Peru that is well known for being one of the biggest plazas in the city of Pacopa. A lot of kids come here as the plaza holds events primarily aimed at children. Even the mascot of this place is designed to appeal to a young audience, which is pretty evident by the numerous TV ads run by this mall. I look creepy. With so many kids running around the place, it's no nah. surprise that accidents often happen here. But one accident in particular has left many people unsettled. In 2016, a young girl named Valentina Yamalith had been playing around at an instant photo booth where an exposed cable from the machine was touching a metal railing near the kiosk. Valentina grabbed onto the railing and was instantly electrocuted. Dang. Unfortunately, due to the high voltage she received, Valentina was pronounced deceased only hours later. Understandably, Valentina's suit. family had mourned and grieved for days on end. Yeah, they Fast got forward to a few years later, the and Valentina's frick. story is no longer talked about. Or so it seems. As of recent, the same plaza where Valentina had passed away has been experiencing strange activity within its stores. It's late at night, after business hours, when a surveillance camera up, inside a store it. captures this. <laughs> wait, hold on. Wait, wait, see how fast? I didn't see how fast I want to go back. What the? Is she the Flash? <laughs> what the fuck? The video shows what looks to be a small child zooming back and forth at a speed beyond human capacity. Yeah, that's As if crazy. seeing a child alone inside a store that is closed wasn't strange enough, it runs at a supernatural speed. Employees of the mall can't help but think that this may have been the ghost of Valentina, given the tragic history of this plaza. She thought, but you be the judge. She thought she was, was the spirit of Valentina of caught on camera. The Incredibles. Or had something else been captured? <laughs> Number seven. It's late at night when the following happens. The person recording is alone at home when all of a sudden something bone chilling is caught on camera. Now the person in question is known as Caitlin, and it was two years ago that she was involved in a terrible accident. On August 8th of 2020, Caitlin jumped off a rope swing at a very high Ooh. altitude, causing her to break her neck after landing on a pile of rocks. Mm. This injury was so severe that she had to stay home for more than a few weeks until she recovered. But during her stay at home, Caitlin would encounter something that still haunts her to this day. No one else is home when this is captured. 
Dang, she at home alone. No Macaulay Culkin. Injured with a. What was that? Was that a growl? Half four closing the doors. <laughs> what is this IRL FNAF for? What the frick? You gotta hear if he's laughing though. You gotta check the closet too. Foxy might be in there. Both? No. No. Somehow, the two doors open on their own, Both seemingly open. at the same time. What the frick? Feeling beyond spooked, Caitlin sits on her bed, paralyzed with fear. Soon after, the video comes to an end, but this wouldn't be the last of it, as only a few days later, this happens. That is super. That is super creepy. So, so the, much, much more than one. Dang, it's going. Close the door. Why the door open? Bro, am I bugging? Door open the whole time, right? Like, like, listen to how loud the footsteps are. That's like a grown man. A... Bro. <laughs> Bro. Just like before, the same door closes on its own, it's leading loud. viewers to believe that the room itself is haunted. Since then, Caitlin hasn't talked about this or the previous incident. Given how frightened she seemed in both encounters, it might be best to forget about them. After how, all, how you gonna forget about it, bro? It's bad enough she, you know, she broke her, her broke her neck, so she gotta be stuck in there. Where her? I mean, unless her parents at work or something. Where her parents at? Like, 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 like she gotta have somebody at the house. Uh, because this ain't, this ain't, this this is ain't, this ain't it. Both the doors opening, the doors slamming mad hard. Do do on some fee fi fo fum. I smell the blood of an English man or whatever they said. Like bruh, <laughs> need somebody in the house. This terrifying encounter still haunts her to this day. Yeah, I would have, I would have pooped on myself. I ain't gonna lie. Number six. I would have pulled it myself. Or In this short video, a famous musician from Argentina had posted something pretty spooky that occurred at a friend's house. He met a baron was visiting a very close friend who she's known for over five years. Never has she ever encountered anything like this. Hey, while boy. Being at a oh, boy. Place. According to her, she was sitting outside in the backyard when suddenly she felt as though someone had grabbed her shoulder. She immediately gets up and turns around to see who it is. But strangely, no one is there. Now, although this incident doesn't seem that strange, it's the video itself that's by far the strangest. It wasn't until looking at the footage captured by the security camera outside that Jimena was left extremely terrified. If you zoom in on the video, you can see what appears to be a set of fingers touching Jimena's shoulder. Uh, yeah, it's hard to make out it. at first, but if you pause the video at the right time, you can see what looks like a row of like distorted clothes. fingers. Now what makes this even creepier is that Jimena stands up soon after the hand appears. Because of this, viewers believe that something had actually touched her. 
But as always, what are your thoughts on this? Ghost or something else? You let me know. I want to feel some flesh. That would scare me too. The following video comes from a man named Bobby who lives with his daughter inside a house where unusual activity has been happening recently. Bobby can't shake the feeling that something is haunting both him and his daughter. He's been documenting these strange occurrences ever since they started, Freaking but out of all occurrences, the following has left him the most unsettled. Bobby's in his living room when out of nowhere, strange noises come from his bedroom. He grabs his phone and records the following. It's always a freaking moment. It's either in my room or Sky's room, but Sky's passed out right now. But it's crazy. Yeah. So she's sleeping. See, I'm telling you, I keep hearing weird shit. I think it's coming from my room now. I'll hear nothing. know about these freaking these freaking toys bro you wondering why there's stuff going on look at the freaking cl pantry closet thingamajigger look look at all these mother freaking dolls man mad creepy they look old they look scary the f like man i don't know what that sound is though like these old 1900 as dolls. Oh, what the f is that, man? Yo, yo, f this, f this. The sound of footsteps is heard right behind him as though someone had walked into the room. Spooked out by the noise, he proceeds to close the cabinet and walk out. Cabinet. For the next few months, Bobby would continue to post videos of strange happenings in his home, but it's the most recent video that has left him the most concerned. He's alone at home when this is captured. I know y'all hear the footsteps. I'm like shaking already. <laughs> So early in the morning too. See, I know you hear him pacing in there. Don't tell me about to go in that room. Now mind you, that's where all the dogs at man. In that mother freaking cabin. <laughs> nah. nah, get out of here, man. Look at these dolls he has, bro. That's what they're making noise. Seriously, the same room where the footsteps were heard opens up on its own. Like before, Bobby was spooked out of his mind, but it seems not as much as when the following incident had occurred. Bobby is once again alone at home when something unexplainable happens inside his daughter's room. This is what he captured. It always gets crazy when I'm here by myself or when my daughter's sleeping. What? See? I told you. I want our piano again. Hello? You need to get rid of those. See, there's her piano. You need to get rid of those puppies, man. Don't mind her room. She has so many damn toys. You gotta clean up like every day in here. Hello? 
say hello? <sighs> Bro calling out to it. Uh -uh. But at least y'all caught that part. <laughs> Yo. Uh-uh. No, no. I'm good. Shut that. Take a little walk outside. I'm telling you, every time I'm here by myself, man. I think I just had a robot. See, look, if her piano is still going off in there, man. The toys inside his daughter's room yeah, mysteriously start going off by themselves. Minute. Now, not much else is known about Bobby's situation, but he continues to post these strange happenings on his channel. He hopes that someone will explain what's happening, as the activity in his house seems to be getting stranger and stranger. I wasn't too bad, though. A little creepy. Not too bad, though. Now, the exact source of the following clip is unknown. It was reposted by someone who found the video somewhere. Even without a source, though, the footage is still terrifying on its own. It starts off with a group of men who are looking down a manhole. They swear that they either saw someone or something inside it. The man recording takes a closer look and sees this. Man, they saw the lizard from the Amazing Spider-Man. <laughs> <laughs> Holy, without warning. The head of someone or something pops into view under the open manhole. Its sudden appearance was enough to send the man running away. Like something straight out of a horror movie, the face seemingly disappears as a man steps back. Whatever this was remains a total mystery, but real or not, the unexpected appearance of this ghoulish face is the stuff of nightmares. Drum my heart drop. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos Got you'd milk. like me to check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get back to the video. Number three. This next video was taken inside a mansion yeah, that is well that. known for being extremely haunted. On July 30th of 2022, Sabrina and her husband Carl decide to take husband. a tour of the Aston Hall mansion located in Birmingham, England. The place itself isn't just known for being haunted, but also for its immaculate architecture that many are taken aback when seeing it in person. But it seems that the real reason people come here okay. isn't just to admire the beauty of this place, but to experience the hauntings that tourists have encountered. Why? There is a room in this mansion that once belonged to a young woman named Why? Mary Holt. The story goes that Mary's father had heard that she planned to run away and marry one of the servants who worked there. Upset that his daughter would do such a thing, he goes to her room and locks her inside. Years would pass, and Mary would still be locked up inside this room. It was after 16 years of being grounded that Mary passed away. It is said that she died of starvation, but also partly of a broken heart. Now, 16 years. She was locked in there for 16 years. Starvation. Um, I'm calling Cap on that. The story itself is quite tragic, but it seems that it wasn't tragic enough for Sabrina's husband, as according to her, he thought it would be funny to call out Mary after learning about her story. This is something Sabrina regrets, as she says that if it wasn't for her spouse calling out Mary, this chilling encounter wouldn't have happened. The two are climbing up the stairs to Mary's room when this is captured. I'll let the pictures. Mary? You mean you know how? I'm... I think we've seen this on, um, Nuke. We know you're in that. I think we've seen it on uh, Nuke. We've seen you. Who are you, Mary? Because they can't go up here, ain't it? Or not supposed to. Why is he calling out to it, bro? Why? Where, bro? Yes. Mary. Bro, Are you still up. in there, Mary? You can come out now. Bro. Oh, 
inside Mary's old room, a shadow-like figure darts across the chamber in a swift motion. The two stand in silence while breathing heavily in anticipation. It doesn't show itself again until moments later after being called out by Sabrina's husband, as though acknowledging the husband's summoning. Now something worth mentioning is that the couple doesn't enter the room to see what's inside. The reason for not doing so, according to them, is that the museum prohibits anyone from entering the room. As with any historical piece on display, this one is off limits to the public. To this day, Sabrina and her husband have no idea as to who in or even what was caught on camera. That thing is she in there. Number two. A family who lives in England has been capturing video evidence of strange happenings inside their home. Ever since 1997, the family has been seeing things that they can't seem to explain. More often than not, the they quarter. would hear strange noises coming out of nowhere and even see things move on their own. To the family, it seems that with every unusual occurrence that happens, the activity intensifies. Now, although they live in a constant state of fear, they still try their best to live comfortably in their own home. On one occasion, Ten. the family makes time to chat with one another and a friend of theirs who is visiting them. The father records the occasion on his phone, as moments like this rarely happen. All is going well, when suddenly, this happens. He always pushes it through when I'm sitting on the sofa. <laughs> it's so annoying. Why are you moving? Closer and closer towards me, and almost in my lap, never. <laughs> oh, so why is that in your coat? Because <laughs> you're ready to run. <laughs> Don't you trust over there anymore, weather? No, I'm all good, thanks. <laughs> Why you moved out in the first place? One of the reasons, yeah. Oh, God. And he's not in the oven. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Her running in the house? <laughs> you go. I'm all right. I'm all good together. Yeah, good together. They are. <laughs> It always happens on TV. Yeah. yeah, this must be happening a lot because they do not care. Oh, I did go. There's nothing there. No, I can't. There's nothing there. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> As if things inside their home have finally settled, this happens. The sound of heavy footsteps walking about is right Fast. above them. Seeming slightly unfazed, as they've seen stranger things before, they laugh about it and proceed to check on the source. Yeah, but after standing that. momentarily at the base of the stairs, yeah. an unseen presence runs down at full speed. This may just be the scariest encounter they've ever had. But until more videos are posted, it seems that this one will stand out from any other creepy occurrence they experience. Sounded mad too. Do, 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 do. Number. Okay. When it comes to videos of oh baby monitors God. that capture Bro. something paranormal on camera, Why? they usually tend to be creepy. Bro. But this next video may just be a lot more wholesome than scary. Whitney Allen is the you mother of two children that. whose father tragically passed away in 2022 after suffering a brain injury caused by a bee sting. Apparently, Whitney's husband was severely allergic to bees. Oh. The bee sting he received was enough to send his body into cardiac arrest and Damn. affect his brain. After months of being in hospice care, he sadly passed away. To Whitney, the passing of her husband was extremely agonizing. But for him to pass away only three months later after the birth of their second child was painfully devastating. Yeah, that's, yeah. The fact that he wasn't able to stay for long to see their child grow up was unbearable to think about. Now, even though she feels that her husband wasn't able to meet their baby in a meaningful way on Earth, she believes that he was able to do so from the beyond. That's... Late one evening, Whitney is looking over at the baby monitor so when she sees a mysterious light on her child's head. At first, she thought this light was just a reflection on the screen, but when her child changed position on the bed, the light was still there. She couldn't help but think that this orb was actually her husband as it seemed to be patting and stroking the baby's head. Uh, I don't be believing that be, uh, that be family member, bro. That be a mother freaking demon acting like it's a freaking family member. Nah, cause even if, 
even if one of my 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 sisters were to die, I don't want them to to quote unquote even just be around the house. Once you're gone, you're gone, okay? Because they know how scary I am. All right, so I just rather just be left alone. Once you're gone, I'll I'll just remember you by pictures and videos. That's it. You don't gotta you don't gotta come back. You know what I'm saying? I'm chilling at the house. I hear something tip over. I hear. A, I'm good. Doors just randomly open. I don't need that. I don't need it. I'm, I'm a okay. After months of experiencing total agony, seeing this had brought Whitney a sense of peace. Even though her husband had passed away, she takes comfort in the thought that somehow he's still here. Hey. As with most videos, feel free to let me know your thoughts on this one. This is a good video. This is good. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Until next time. That is good. This is good. I would have to get this a mother freaking W, okay? A little scary. A tad bit spooky. But I'm going to give it a W, man. Um, the, I think the craziest one where the one the, the, the woman broke her neck and the two doors was opening. And I think the cherry on top, bro, the freaking whipped cream with the sprinkles on top, if the door would have opened and something would just send a solid figure, or the muff, the muff freaking, the muff freaking hat man, not Batman, but <laughs> hopefully y'all enjoyed it. You did know what to do. Go back to the way. Ooh. -wee.